Hot Saucy Monkey here with my gorgeous wife, Hot Saucy Lady. Having a hard time talking tonight for whatever reason, but here we are. So we want to wish you a happy Easter. Happy Easter. And I'm going to let her go back to what she was doing while I do a quick review on Rick Orlando's legendary Dirty Blonde Sweet and Sticky Hot Sauce. So here we go there so y'all can see it. So this was um, a sauce that was sent to me uh, to try, and I want to review it and see if it's good. I should probably shake it. Uh, it smells great, though, just for the record. All right, should have been pre-shaken by me, but I didn't do it. All right, so I'm going to try it here on just some uh, honey ham, right? So see if this is uh, good. Just going to put a little bit. Or at least a little bit for me. And uh, I believe it's going to be really good, right? So, all right. Apparently, I didn't cut this very well. Mm. That really is... Um, Really sweet, it has a good pepper kick. I can taste, I can taste the pepper, I can taste the habanero. Mm. You know what? I'm gonna even uh, put a little bit here on this deviled egg because it's just good. You know what? All right, y'all. Um, clearly, I like it because I'm putting it on everything. I'm putting it on everything. Oh, my gosh. Brussels sprouts. It's just all oh, so good. Yeah. I know it was given to me. That doesn't mean I won't give a true, accurate description of what I think. I would absolutely recommend getting some Dirty Blonde sauce. So good. Mm. So good. Hot Saucy Monkey out.